So here is our question x cube minus 4x minus 9 equal to 0 we need to solve using regular Farsi method. So the first step that we need to do is we need to find the interval. So interval means our x will be lying between a certain value. We need to find that value. So for finding that value we need to write the same question like that itself as f of x. So after that we need to substitute for x as 0, 1, 2, 3, 4 like that. So f of 0 means wherever there is x substitute with 0. So 0 q minus 4 into 0 minus 9 that is equal to minus 9. Then f of 1 that is 1 cube minus 4 into 1 minus 9 that is equal to minus 12. Then f of 2 that is 2 cube minus 4 into 2 minus 9 that is equal to minus 9. Then f of 3 that is 3 cube minus 4 into 3 minus 9 that is equal to 6. So f of 4. Do we need to find that f of 4? No need because we got a consecutive negative and positive value. Our 0 will be lying in between that negative and positive value. So, so thus we found the interval that is 2 and 3. Our interval is 2 and 3. Our 0 is lying between that interval. So we found the interval 2. I am going to substitute as a then 3 I am going to substitute as b. Then f of 2 that is f of a. f of 3 means f of b. So f of a I got the value as minus 9 that is less than 0. Then f of b that is 6 that is greater than 0 positive value greater than 0. So up to this much clear. So thus we got our interval and for in regular policy method the formula is f of b minus f of a divided by f of b minus f of a. In numerator substitute a near f of b and b near f of a. So this is the formula for solving using regular policy method. Up to this much clear? Perfect. Better now. So basically two things you have to do. Turn on the calculator. Then you need to reset the calculator first. For that shift mod 3 equal to equal to. Again I will say shift mod 3 equal to equal to. Now I reset the calculator. Now I need to fix the number of decimal place. In question they will ask up to 4 decimal up to 3 decimal. For that purpose press mod button again 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 again. Now you can see a fix button. Fix. Press 1. That is they are asking 0 to 9. How many decimal we need to fix? So I am going to uh, fix 3 decimals. So I am typing or pressing 3. Now 3 decimals that is it and press AC. Okay. Now our first part is completed. Now the second thing. So in calculator I am going to do this operation f of a equal to a cube minus 4a minus 9. For f of a I am going to write c. For a cube capital A 4a minus 9. I am going to write like this. Okay. So press the alpha button then press c you can see c here right c then for getting equal to sign press alpha then press the calc button equal to now press alpha then press a then shift x square that will be cube so then a cube minus alpha into not alpha 4 into alpha a 4 a minus 9 then we need to put a colon Okay, semicolon or colon, colon. So colon is there. Now we need to type the second equation. For that, we know f of b equal to b cube minus 4b minus 9. So for f of b, I am going to write it as capital D. So it will be for b, b itself. So b cube minus 4b minus 9. Okay, so I put a colon, colon here. Now after that, press alpha, then capital D d then alpha equal to then alpha b shift x square that means cube minus 4 then alpha b minus 9 then put colon now we need to type our next equation okay our next equation will be our formula x1 equal to a into f of b minus b into f of a divided by f of b minus f of a for that purpose i already know f of a is c then f of b is no sorry f of b is d f of a is c 
then a it is a itself capital a then for b it is capital b f of b means it is f of b means d f of a means c so my x1 for x1 i am going to substitute in calculator as x so x equal to ad minus bc divided by d minus c okay so this equation i am going to put in calculator and after the colon i am going to write alpha then x x then alpha equal to then put bracket alpha a alpha d minus alpha b alpha c cross the bracket divided by alpha d minus alpha c now i completed the equation and after completing the equation put colon colon then the next equation so after finding x1 what we will do we will find f of x1 f of x1 means x1 cube minus 4x1 minus 9 for f of x1 i am going to substitute as capital e and x1 x itself so x cube minus 4x minus 9 in calculator so after this colon i am going to write alpha e e alpha equal to then alpha x shift cube minus 4 alpha x minus 9 now all the equations are completed now we will get the x1 value x2 value like that okay now press after all this equation press the calc button now they are asking our a value that is our interval a we know our a is 2 so i press 2 then i got f of a f of a as minus 9 then they are asking me b b is 3 i got f of b as 6 now x is our value so first x1 we will get x1 so i'm going to write x1 equal to 2.6 x1 equal to 2.6 then f of x1 f of x1 i got as minus 1.824 so i got a negative value for that purpose i need to replace a a with x1 so my new x1 will be 2.6 new a will be 2.6 then i got f of x1 minus 1.824 b is 3 i got f of b is 6 then my new x2 value x2 will be 2.693 then our f of x2 will be minus 0.237 so negative value i need to replace a interval a with the 2.693 so they are asking my a so it is 2.693 then i will get f of a as 0.242 b it is 3 itself and i will get 6 new value new x3 value is 2.705 then f of x3 f of x3 it is minus 0 0.029 it is a negative value therefore i need to replace again a with the x3 so x3 is 2.705 i will get it as oh that is f of x f of a it is 0 0.027 b it is 3 6 then new value of x so my x4 will be my x4 will be equal to 2.706 then f of x4 f of x4 i will get minus 0 0.003 which is approximately equal to 0 and again we can do we are going to replace a with the 2.706 then i will get f of a then b it is 3 then f of b my new value of x will be again 2.706 then x5 x5 it is minus 0 0.001 which is almost equal to 0 so i got my x the value of x after regular falsy method as 2.706 after five iterations so this is the method by which we can do it in calculator regular falsi method